You all know that Windows is a popular operating system available for computers, but now you can also use it on your Android phone, even offline. It means you can run high-end games on Android without a PC. In fact, you can customize your Windows according to your preferences, such as choosing your desired graphics card and number of processors. Installing it is super easy. Just watch the complete video and you'll understand the entire process well. So, let's start the video. Let's roll. At the moment, you can see that I have this fairly powerful phone with me and it has 6 GB of RAM installed. Today, I am going to install Windows on this phone. Speaking of minimum system requirements, you should have at least 4 GB of RAM to be able to install it on your phone. Guys, first of all, you need to install Zip Extractor, a small app that can be easily installed. After installation, you need to navigate to the folder where you downloaded the Windows zip file. The zip file size is not large, just 280 MB. Simply click on it and extract it. Once the extraction is complete, you will see an APK file that you need to install. So, here our APK file has been installed. Let's open it now. When you open it for the first time, it will take a little time to launch. Once it's launched, you need to click on the plus icon above. Then, you need to type any name for your operating system here. Below, you'll see all the options that are already configured according to your device. But still, you can change them according to your preference. You'll also find some options related to the graphics card below, which you can change if you want. But for now, I'll leave all these options at their default settings and save them. Once you click on save, it will create a container, so you'll need to wait for a moment. One hour later. After the container is created, you'll see an interface like this. You'll then need to click on these three dots and choose the run option. All right, our Windows has been installed, and you can see how smooth it is. This level of smoothness might not even be achievable on your computer. Below, you'll find the start menu from where you can access my computer. Additionally, let's talk about installing games or software. It's quite simple too. Whatever game or software you want to install, you just need to place it in the Android slash download folder. Then, you can access that folder from the D drive in my computer. Here, you can see that applications are also working smoothly. Overall, I found this method of running Windows on Android quite appealing, and I hope you liked it too. Oh, I forgot to mention one thing. Whatever game you install, you can also play it by key mapping. I haven't run games on it yet, but I might do so in upcoming videos. So make sure to subscribe to the channel and turn on the bell notification. Apart from that, feel free to check out these videos. They might be of some help to you.